And I am actually about to wash my hair and deep condition it tonight. And I really just want to show you guys how it's looking. It's definitely dry and crusty at this point. But, yeah, it's super dry. But I did make it a whole entire week without having to re-moisturize my hair. And I feel like if I didn't use gel on my twist out, which don't think I'm gonna be doing that again. I don't usually do that, but I try to do that. Hi guys, so here's what my hair is looking like straight out of the shower um no product on it i just washed it with the cantu shea butter for natural hair sulfate free cream shampoo and i condition it with the best conditioner ever which is the aussie total miracle 71 revitalizing conditioner with the apricot and australian macadamia oil and now i'm gonna deep condition my hair and i'm gonna deep condition using the aunt jackie's coconut cream Coco Repair Deep Conditioner. It looks like this. And I got it on sale for $4 at Family Dollar in the clearance section, honey. So, yeah, we are going to moisture out this hair. I think I'm going to add some oil to it, too. I think I'm going to do some, some olive oil. So, I'm just drying my hair a little bit. And don't mind my hairy armpits. Save the body shaming, please, ladies. Cause a bitch ain't hit her armpits out. It's the winter time, okay? I'm just gonna take really big sections cause I'm lazy and my hair is not really that thick. I'm gonna take some big globfuls like this much and start at the end and work my way up. I'm gonna split it and try to work it through every section. I kind of stopped finger detangling because I feel like that was breaking my hair up. So I actually use a comb now. And I feel like that works much more efficiently with my hair. A big amount of oil. I love how my hair texture is when I have deep conditioner in my hair. It doesn't look anything like this when it's dry. As you can see, this is my hair texture in the middle of my hair, so starting to get less texture as opposed to the other section. This is like much thicker area of my hair. So I'm gonna try to use an even bigger glob. How oh, about that? I'm getting a little bit of shed hair, but nothing too much. My hair doesn't really shed like that anymore. is the front section of my hair with no product this part of my hair is like wavy in texture girl it's just i have so many different curl patterns all over my head i don't need as big of a lump right here because my hair gets much thinner in the front an extremely high high porosity or Girl, don't talk me a lot about the porosities. My hair at the front, it dries like immediately. So I don't know, I think that means high porosity. Again, super undefined hair. Nice big clump. And 
there's almost like a, a lack of texture. I have to create texture on certain parts of my hair. All deep conditioned. Come back to you guys once I rinse this out. I'm gonna leave it in for a couple of hours, to be honest. It's good, guys. So, I just rinsed my hair out with some cool water. And this, this is what we're looking like. Very pretty and moisturized hair. Hi guys, so it's the next day. I look crazy because I literally just woke up, but I wanted to show you guys the results of my amazing deep conditioner. This is with no product. My hair is still a little bit damp. But I just wanted to show you guys how it turned out and how moisturized my hair is.